पैशात दाई येतील ना काय
hello g um thanks all for watching the video uh this this video i shot in uh, july 2018 in kungri monastery based at pin valley in spiti uh, i was actually based at spiti at that time full time i was part of the tourism industry during that time and i was lucky enough and blessed enough to have the access um, to all the events and processes of the of the of the festival of the cham festival that was happening at that time uh, at kungri monastery for those of you who don't know much about kungri monastery it is is one of the five uh, main monasteries of spiti valley it is based pretty cl close to uh, you know a village called guling and uh, it's a beautiful monastery a must visit for those who want to see something new um the, the the quality of video might not be as great um as, as some of my people might be expecting because uh, at that time i was not really very you know technically sound at shooting the videos for such you know events uh, while i am doing the photography for a long time but yeah at that time video was something very new for me but i just i just started shooting what i was looking at the beautiful dance festival and unfortunately i ha i am not very good at editing the video so uh, that was one of the reason the content was lying with me for last 3 years and i was not you know processing it so day before yesterday i thought it's a good time to process it but besides probably a low quality of the video the content of the video has got a great religious significance in itself cham festival itself contains of cham dance which is also called as mass dance uh, it also sometime you know contains uh, bochan festival or a bochan warrior uh, performance sometimes and uh, sometime it also you know consist of um the dance the modern age uh, local dance by the local kids so it's it's kind of a festival which consists of a lot of uh, things religiously connected to buddhism cham often uh, depicts incidents from the life of guru padma sambhava the 19th century nigmapa teacher and some other saints chams are considered as a form of meditation and uh, and an offering to god the leader of the you know cham festival is is typically a musician musician which which keeps a time using some percussion instruments um, musical instruments and keep a track of the whole process so i i hope you like the the video um, i'll be i will be trying to capture this whole event again because it's a very very beautiful religious event so hopefully next year i'll be attending some more uh, cham festivals to really get details of it thank you again for watching